the blonde I left in the front. Oh, boom. Somebody come get me. You want that melanin popping? Get yellow. Yellow. Waffle House yellow. Come through. Yellow. Hi guys, welcome back to Beauty with Ty. So today's video, I'll be showing you guys how I got this really, really bomb yellow. As you've seen from the beginning of the video, I was feeling myself, honey, this, this is it it's lit so let's get right into it the hair that i received is from yg wigs and this is their 613 custom wig it came with some clips stay bomb too these are the good clips comes with a little brochure letting you know all about the hair a wig cap elastic band and it came in this bag so this is their peruvian straight hair and again this is their 613 lace front wig and as you can see um has the tracks in the back last well the adjustable straps and the hairline has been pre-plucked so i didn't have to do any of that when i put it on it was like whoo chow but i'm just showing you guys how it looks straight out of the box if you want you can keep the wig this color but i decided to color mine yellow so that's what we're going to go ahead and do so I'm showing you guys two colors, the Kiss as well as the Ion in the color Lemon. I only recommend using the Ion in the color Lemon because the Kiss, it I guess because I mixed it with conditioner, it didn't work. So I did test out the colors first and see how they look without conditioner and with conditioner. But um, I didn't wash it out, so that was a mistake that I made. So make sure you are testing out your colors and washing out so you can see. So I took the Kiss color and mixed it with conditioner, which I don't recommend because it didn't work out right. And you guys will see that later on. Just skip this. Um, well, just use the Ion and the color Lemon and just do these same steps. So I'm not going all the way up to the root of the hair because I still wanted my roots to kind of be blonde in the front. Well, I did want them blonde in the front. And I'm just using my brush and just going through the hair and add on the color. So, um, again, just use the Ion and the color Lemon. It gives you like a more softer yellow versus the Kiss Electric Yellow. It gives you like a um, more like a really, really bright, bright yellow i don't know it was a difference so i'm just sectioning off the hair and adding in the color not going all the way up to the root like i said and that's how i got that look in the front and i also sectioned out some blonde hair in the front so that i can have that little streak so this is what it looks like just the front area where the lace is pretty much so here i'm taking some of the kiss an electric yellow and just adding it to the ends because i wanted to have like almost like a gradient effect any it ended up like blended in but i wanted the ends to be like a lot more yellow and vibrant so that's why i went ahead and added just that color to the ends and now i'm taking the kiss color and I added some conditioner in it like I did the front and adding it throughout the hair, which you do want to color the hair like this. You just don't want to use the Kiss Color with conditioner because it didn't work. Just add your regular yellow color. Unless you like that, uh, you know, electric yellow. But that wasn't the color I was going for. I was trying to go for like a really soft yellow. So this is what it looks like. You want to color the hair just like this. Use the techniques, but just use the ion color. So I just plaited the um, blonde piece up, kept that in my hand while I rinsed it out so that it didn't get any of the yellow color on it. So here I'm rinsing it out. And as you can see, it's like the color is coming out with it. I was so disappointed and just sad and over it <laughs> for real. But um, see the ends, they're good because I didn't add any conditioner to it. But the rest of the hair, you can't even tell I colored it so yeah and i was supposed to like dry the hair and then color it again y'all i didn't even dry the hair i just wanted to add in the color so here i'm using the ion and the color lemon and i didn't add any conditioner or anything to it um just section it off the same way i did the first time and adding it to the front of the wig not going all the way up to the root again just adding it 
um, on the hair. So this is how you want to do it starting off from the first step, really. So just combing that through, adding in my yellow. And as you can see, it's like a more softer yellow and it's not so electric and vibrant. I don't know. So this is what it looks like after I have washed the wig and conditioned it. So I went ahead and blow dried it and now it's coming together. It looks really good. I didn't add any conditioner, so everything just worked out great. So I'm just going to go ahead and blow dry the wig so that I can um, curl it because I end up curling it first. And look at that blonde streak in the front. It looks so good. I think I'm going to do like all my color wigs like this. Just leave that um, top area blonde. So, yes. So, here I'm just curling the hair. I'm using my um, curlers from Olaxer. It's an Amazon-based company. And just curling the hair. And, um, yeah. And right there, you can kind of see a little bit of the electric yellow on the tip. So that's all I'm doing is just curling it. And then I went through and um, got the front to kind of be sleek and pulled over just using my curlers. And then I went ahead and pin curled the hair, which made the hair kind of look funny. I should just left it alone. <laughs> I learned so much stuff on this uh wig, but I added some foundation to the inside of the lace and now I'm taking my 91% rubber alcohol and going against my um hairline and I'm using lace grip glue. Don't really like it. I'm going to stick to my ghost bomb, but I can't find it, so I got to order some more. And now I'm just applying my wig in sections like I always do. You guys see this all the time, but I thought I'll still show you guys um just in case I got some new subscribers looking and you can see how I lay my wigs. And this is usually how I do it. So, just put that on, then I go ahead and take um like this little band. It's actually from my robe and just apply that so that it can like melt so then i'll just pull out um a little pieces in the front just to try to make some baby hair not too much um just like really thin pieces and i spray the got to be glue free spray on my finger and then put it on the hair so that it doesn't make my lace lift because it has alcohol in it so be careful with that and then i'm just gonna go ahead and comb out my curls and y'all it looks so good oh my god that yellow my niece was the one who um told me to do yellow she said it looked real cute and i did it and oh my god yeah, I just love it. So, you guys, let me know if you try this out and how you like this. And, you know, like with that little um, blonde in the front. I thought that was really cute. So, I want to do another wig. Let me know some other colors I should do. And I can definitely get that out. So, I also decided to straighten the hair. And I think I like it better straightened. I don't know. You guys let me know if you like it better um curled or straightened but that straight it was so sleek even though i colored the hair twice the hair was still bomb and smelled so good so yeah. y'all this wig is everything and some more oh my god so gorgeous super soft the bomb this custom color by Mwah. bomb i don't even know how to act mm, 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 mm. look at this Look at that. That little bit of blonde I left in the front. Ah, oh, somebody come get me. You want to slay? You want that melanin popping? Get yellow. 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 Waffle House yellow. Come through. Yellow. Oh, okay. I got to go because I'm going to keep playing in my hair.